if you're facing the error, a GPU supporting D3D feature level 12 or higher is required while playing The Last of Us Part 1, here are some solutions you can try to fix the issue. Solution 1. Use a compatible graphics card. This error occurs when your graphics card does not support DirectX 12, which is required by the game. If you're using an older or incompatible GPU, you will need to upgrade to a graphics card that supports DirectX 12 to resolve the issue. Ensure your system meets the game's minimum GPU requirements before attempting other solutions. Solution 2. Update graphics drivers. 1. Visit the NVIDIA or AMD official website, depending on your GPU. 2. Download the latest driver for your graphics card. 3. Install the driver and restart your PC to ensure the changes take effect. Solution 3. Roll back the graphics driver. 1. Right-click the Start button and open Device Manager. 2. Locate your GPU under Display Adapters, right-click, and select Properties. 3. Go to the Driver tab and click on Rollback Driver. Choose an older version of the driver, if available, and restart your system. Solution 4. Increase. Virtual Memory 1. Open the Advanced System Settings from the search bar. 2. Under the Performance section, click Settings, and then go to the Advanced tab. 3. Adjust the virtual memory size by selecting Custom Size and enter a higher value based on your RAM. 1.5 times your RAM size. Apply the changes and restart your PC. Solution 5. Run the game on a dedicated graphics card. 1. Open graphics settings in Windows. 2. Add The Last of Us Part 1 to the list if it's not already there. 3. Set the game to run in high performance mode on your dedicated GPU, NVIDIA, or AMD. 4. Launch the game and see if the issue is resolved. Solution 6. Verify integrity of game files. 1. Open Steam and go to your library. 2. Right-click on The Last of Us Part 1 and select Properties. 3. Under the Local Files tab, click on Verify Integrity of Game Files. 4. Steam will check for missing or corrupt files and automatically fix them.